Hi, Christian. Nancy here at Porsche Colorado Springs coming at you with this 2008 Turbo. So she's a little sandwiched in here, but let's do a little walk around video for you anyway, okay? So she's just going through, went through the service process, gonna be going through detail next, um, but we could get a good look at her even though, even though I can't quite get her out right now, that's okay. That's all right. All right, so I've got, I see a little, um, a little scuff right here has the front license plate bracket on. It does have some, a little bit of uh, scuffing underneath the lip here. You can feel that. That chin piece is something that, uh, we just don't worry about it here. <laughs> you know, stuff gets scraped and we just don't worry about it. All right, this is a 997 Turbo Porsche. Absolutely beautiful, love the gray. Um, it's got side, clear, uh, side markers that are clear, red brake calipers. The wheels look great. Honestly, only that one scuff that I've seen so far, a few little rock chips, and that uh, that's a, actually a raindrop. That's just dust. You know, you'd think snow would be cleaner, but it just isn't. Okay. Um, all right, and then of course you got the uh, clear marker there from the factory on the rear quarter panel. I think that's just a little bit of scraping from when tires are replaced. It looks really pretty. I appreciate those caps that somebody put on. And who doesn't love the back end of a 997 Turbo? Look at that. She is pretty. No, I mean, overall, the paint and everything looks really nice. It looks very, very clean. Look at that beautiful metallic. That wheel looks great, too. Um, the air intakes look really good. I don't see any like peppering or anything like that. Everything just looks really good. And there's not even a clear mask on it. I kind of wonder if at one point it had paint protection film on it and they removed it because it just doesn't last forever because it seems really nice. It seems really nice for the year for sure. And again, you know, a few little rock chips here and there, but it's just kind of normal for, for life here. A little scuff right there. You can put the roof rails on it here. Tinted windows already. Oh, I should probably unlock it. That would require me to get the key out. Hang on one moment. All right, let's take a peek inside. Uh, 69,772 miles on the odometer. I'll tell you what, I wouldn't really guess that by looking at her. She looks really good. Look at that dash. The dash looks really, really good. The interior pieces look great. The leather looks really good. Power seats, Bose sound system. Very nice. I love the white instrument cluster. Heated front seats. Look at that phone. You can even use the Bluetooth and dial the phone. Look at that. <laughs> That's a throwback right there, isn't it? Okay, and bear with me. I'm sorry about the camera work here. It's a little nippy out. Okay, let's take a peek at the back. I really like this. I like that there's the plastic across the back of the seats. It just keeps it really nice. The seats look great. The carpet looks really good. It actually really truly is surprising that it has a, just about 70,000 miles on it. The sport chrono clock looks great. Again, I love it in the white. Look at how clean that is. Those painted inlays that match the exterior of the car, everything just looks really good. Normal little bit of scuffing right here, getting in and out of the threshold, really normal. Again, all the seat leather looks really good. The doors look great. The dash looks great. Let's take a little peek. Honestly, other than a few rock chips and one or two little um, spots where they did a little bit of touch up paint in the front, she looks really, really good. It's beautiful. It, and we did a ton of work to her. So, you know, it's been done right by Porsche Colorado Springs technicians because we're just, we're just the best, what can I say? If this is a beautiful baby for you, you be sure and let me know.